guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday and happy Magic Mail Monday. I hope you all had a wonderful Easter weekend if you celebrate. I mostly worked all weekend, but today I'm actually hosting a baby shower for my sister who is expecting. So most of our family stuff is happening today, which is, is Monday morning as I'm um, filming this. So I'm a little bit under the wire in terms of time to film and edit for you, but I'm gonna try to make Magic Mail Monday happen anyway, and I do have a stack of mail that I pulled off my uh, P.O. Box pile to share with you today, and I'm just gonna get through it as much as I can before I have to turn this off and edit and upload and then go get ready for this baby shower. So this mail has appeared in my P.O. Box from you guys, from subscribers. I super appreciate anyone who ever thinks to send me a card or a gift or an email or a note, and uh, these videos are just my way of being able to, um, to thank you as directly and uh, in real time as I can. So I'm gonna get started and open up some Disney magic mail. And I'm going to begin with this pretty purple mailer. This is from someone that I recognize. This is from Aaron, Aaron with two N's, um, out in California. Aaron has sent me magic mail a couple of times and she's been a subscriber to my channel and we chat sometimes on Facebook and she gave me a little heads up that she had sent me a little treat for Easter. So I'm gonna jump into this one because I know it's Eastery and yesterday was Easter and I'm trying to sort of like stay at least season appropriate with my magic mails because I get a little behind sometimes. So hi Erin and thank you and I better kick crack in here. I'm already getting long-winded. Um, there is a note. It says Disney Kitty. There's some cute um, Mickey stickers on it. Oh and look at the card. It says Happy Easter Princess and it has Belle who is definitely one of my top two Disney princesses. Hey Becca, just want to wish you and your family a happy Easter. I'm so excited for you to see the goodies I sent you, especially the pin. I just became a Disneyland cast member. Oh my gosh, congratulations. Wow, you became a cast member. I wish I could become a Disney cast member. I think that ship has sailed for me, unfortunately, since I live in Minnesota and I'm probably never gonna move, but that's amazing. And I hope I can come uh, visit you when I'm in Disneyland in just a couple of weeks here. So let's see what's in here. I'm gonna start with this. This does not feel like a pin. This actually feels like ears. You sent me ears too? And her note is so cute and funny. It's a quote from Frozen. It says, can I just say something crazy? And then down here it says, hope you love your new ears. I love a little Frozen on a quote. That's adorable. Let's open this up. Here's some ears. Oh my gosh, they're Frozen ears. What? I was actually saying, oh gosh, a couple months ago on my channel that I wished that I had a pair of Frozen inspired ears or Anna inspired ears because I'm such a big fan of Anna. And these are definitely Frozen inspired ears. And there's Anna and Elsa and Olaf. These are so cool. Did you make these? Do you make ears or, or did you get these somewhere? Because these are these are really, really nice. Okay, here's a close-up. I gotta calm down. I'm already getting riled up and I'm only opening the first package. All right, so this is the front. There is a beautiful iridescent silver bow. It's very Frozen-ish. And then on one ear, you've got Anna and she's like one of my favorite Disney characters of all time. And on the other ear, you've got Anna and Elsa. I love the glitter on this fabric too. It's so pretty. Got the little kind of silver bead and embellishment around the edge of the ear and then on the back I mean these could actually be interchangeable there is a snowflake with some ribbons that hang down and then you've got Anna and Elsa and also Olaf and Elsa on this ear these are gorgeous and like I said I've never had a pair of frozen ears and I'm a big fan of that frozen sing-along and I'm planning to see the frozen uh, musical out in Disneyland so I will definitely get some wear out of these Erin these are so awesome and so thoughtful thank you for paying attention to me being like, I wish I had some Anna ears because this is like exactly what I was looking for. Look at how cute she looks and how happy. I just love, I love that Anna. And I can't believe there's more goodies in here. Oh, the next thing I'm pulling out is actually an Easter egg. Yesterday was Easter, but it's Easter all week as far as I'm concerned. Um, let me open this up. I wonder if I'm gonna need a scissors. It's taped very carefully. Pop open a little egg. I wonder what could be uh, hiding in this. Ooh, I think it's a pin, I think it's a pin. And I think it is a Tinkerbell pin. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, yes, this is a great pin. It is Tinkerbell in front of It's a Small World. It's a Tinkerbell 
small world pin. I wonder if this is from a mystery set. I'm not totally sure, um, but let me give you a close-up of this. This is fantastic. And there she is. It is Tinkerbell, my current fave, sprinkling some pixie dust on the small world children, and they're going in front of the, uh, the little clock tower face. I love this. I don't know if I've ever seen this pin before, but it'll be perfect for my Tink collection, and since I also kind of collect a lot of small world pins, it's great for that as well. Perfect pin for me. Thank you. And believe it or not, there's still more things in here. There's something in here. This says, since you are Disney Kitty, I thought this shirt would be perfect for you. Such a thoughtful package. And there's a shirt. Oh, I see Marie. Oh my gosh. It has Marie and it says ladies first. And she looks great. That's a super cute t-shirt. It'll fit me perfect. I'm gonna probably pack this on my upcoming trip. And then when I get in line at Disneyland and Disney World, I'll be like, <clears throat> ladies first, meow. <laughs> this is so nice, thank you. I like wanna put this on now. I'm gonna like maybe wear this to the gym. I don't wanna get it sweaty, but it's just so cute that I wanna wear it today. And the next thing after this is go to the gym. So maybe it's coming to the gym with me. And then last but not least, I've got a couple of items I think from Hong Kong Disneyland. There is a uh, Duffy Bear and Shelly Mae gift tag. So there they are, they look super cute and cozy. Oh my gosh, this makes me wish for it to be the holidays again. Although, not until I have some summer, please. And then also a very cute Shelly Mae sticker. And an extra, extra cute um, Cookie the Dog sticker. I love Cookie. She's one of my favorite Disney dogs. These are lovely, thank you so much. Erin, thank you for such a nice package and also for your friendship. I kind of feel like we're getting to be friends now. I hope I can meet you sometime in the hopefully very near future. And also, Erin and I share a birthday. We both have October 29th birthday, so yay, high five for for birthday twins. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in Disneyland in a couple of weeks. The next package I have arrived at my P.O. Box just a couple of days ago, and it's actually from shopdisney.com. So I think somebody maybe ordered something for me on Shop Disney and had it sent directly to my P.O. Box, which is super nice. That doesn't happen very often, so I was kind of excited to see the return address as shopdisney.com. Very fancy. I'm gonna open up this little box. It feels very light, so I wonder if it's like a clothing item or a plush or something, like something kind of light and fluffy. Here's some uh, Shop Disney tissue and some um, packing material for my cat. My cat loves packing material. And oh, I see what it is. I see what it is. And I'm very excited because this is something that I was actually planning to purchase for myself and I didn't do it yet. Um, but let me just see if there's a note or, I don't see a note. Let me see if I can find a return address. Oh, here we go. Okay, so this is from Andrea in Tennessee. Hi, Andrea in Tennessee. Thank you for buying me a, a present from shopdisney.com. I'm really excited about what you sent me. It's very thoughtful and it's definitely something that I needed to have in my collection. It's from the new Disney Wishables series. The Wishables are their kind of newest line of collectible plush. So first there were the uh, Tsum Tsums, then it was the Oofoofies, then they had the like tiny big feet, and now they have these collectible monthly plush releases called Wishables. And this one, let me show you, is the dog with the keys from Pirates of the Caribbean. This is my favorite uh, animatronic in all of Disneyland and Disney World. I love that scene when you kind of go by in the boat and then there's the pirates in the jail cell and the dog is holding the keys and he's kind of tilting his head and, and taunting them a little bit and they're all like, here doggy, give us the keys. And he's like, woof woof, I don't understand. What could you possibly want from little old me? Just such a cute scene. And there's actually a little plush of the dog with the keys and I, I do collect this, so I'm so excited and thank you so much. Andrea, you are awesome. I'm so happy you sent this to me because I was totally gonna buy this myself and now I don't have to. Plus things are always just a little bit more special when they were sent as a gift. So I'll be keeping my little dog with the keys for forever. And coincidentally, the Wishes candle that I'm burning today, can you see it? It's called Pirate's Rum, and it's Pirates of the Caribbean inspired. It's almost like I planned it this way, but, um, but I didn't. But look at all that glittery, hot, smelly goodness. So yummy, I love this candle. Love me some Wishes candles. Okay, moving on. I have one package left that I'm going to open today, as well as a letter. I will save the letter for last, which is what I, I often do. But I have a, a big-ish box, and this is coming from, 
Leanna in Florida, in Sarasota actually. So hello to Leanna in Sarasota. I really like Sarasota. I've got some family there actually. Um, and thank you for sending me a fun box. Let me open this up and see what is inside. Ooh, I'm seeing something that might actually be um, a little bit fragile. And then I'm also seeing a package within a package. So there's another little mini bubble mailer with a card that says Disney Kitty. And look, there's even cute little kitty and doggy stickers. You all know me so well, it just makes me so happy. Okay, let's go for the card first. It's Olaf and it's Easter. Gosh, all you guys are really on top of it with your holidays. The Easter cards and the Easter eggs and the Easter things, it's so sweet. Dear Becca, I just wanted to thank you for bringing me joy with your videos. It really helps me get through things that are tough in my life. So I hope you enjoy and love everything I sent you. Stay true and keep being you. Love, Leanna. Thank you so much, Leanna. I will be honest, um, making videos and getting to connect with you guys helps me get through the things that are tough uh, in my life. So um, it's mutual and uh, it's very much uh, a reciprocated feeling of gratitude and appreciation. And um, even though I'm the one that's on camera opening packages from you, I, I hope you know that like this channel has done so many good things for my soul and my heart and uh, my life and, and my family even. Um, so I really am truly grateful to, to everybody that's been watching and that's made it possible for me to do luxurious things like sit here on a Monday and open packages. It's just, I know I'm very fortunate, so thank you. Okay, enough of me getting sappy. Let's see what's in this cute little envelope first. Ooh, I think I might even see a pin and some papers. I'm seeing a bunch of just really cute little sheets of stationery. Oops, some of them are really tiny and I'm dropping them. So there's some like kawaii type uh, stationery. A lot of it's like, looks like Japanese stationery. Super cute. Let me just give you a quick close up of the stationeries. I love stuff like this. There's little sheets and then there's like bigger sheets. This is very, I think Alice in Wonderland-ish. Yep, cause there's the Cheshire Cat. Yeah, I love having like all these cute little, little papers. I've got a little collection and I, I try to remember to use them, but they're all so cute that I always feel bad using my pretty stationery. Leave a comment down below if you also are afraid to like mess up pretty notebooks and stationery. I have a really hard time writing on them because I'm like, my handwriting doesn't feel worthy or I'm like, what if I make a mistake on this pretty paper? Uh, I'm very neurotic when it comes to paper goods. Okay, and then the other thing that she sent me is actually a pin set. This is a kind of a brand new pin set and it's so cute. And this is another thing that I probably would have bought for myself. Um, and I'm so excited that you sent it to me. This is the new um, donut, uh, donut pin set. This is available at Shop Disney and Disney Store. The backer card looks like a little cup of coffee, something I have had way too much of today and then there's three donuts you've got a chocolate sprinkle donut and a blue sprinkle donut and then I love this one with the pink sprinkles and the mini bow and a bite taken out like such a cute little pin set these would be great as accessories um, on clothing as well as obviously like in a pin collection but these just seem very wearable to me because they're so teeny and um, and, and colorful and detailed. Yay, I love these. Thank you, Leanna. So tasty and delicious. And now I am pulling out of this box a fancy wrapped fragile thing. Wow, it's like getting a mystery box in the mail. So much fun. I'm open this up and see what is inside. It feels kind of um, like square, like boxy. What could possibly be, Let's keep going and going. What could possibly be in here? Oh my gosh, I know what this is. And I forgot actually that this even existed, but I've seen this when I've been in the parks and I thought, gosh, I'd love to have that. And I, and I didn't buy it because sometimes I'm good and I don't buy everything I see. Um, but this is actually a little tea set. It's like a little miniature tea set. And I, I believe it's Snow White themed. This is so cute. There's several little little pieces here. All right, here comes some close-ups because this is actually amazing. It's like a little decorative um, Snow White tea set. Hold on, let me juggle this around here. So first of this set is the tea kettle and it is shaped like Snow White's cottage, but this little tree branch is the handle and this is the spout and you know, tip me over and pour me out, but it looks like the Snow White um, Seven Dwarves cottage in the woods. So cute, I love the little hearts on the shutters. Beautiful detail 
details on these little figures. Then we have this figure, which I believe is supposed to be the uh, the creamer or the uh, the milk pitcher. So you've got a little turtle, and then he's got a little um, pitcher for for cream or for milk on his back, and he's just adorable as well. Look at that face. He looks so happy. He's like, here's your creamer. I'm a turtle, and I carry the creamer. <laughs> I'm such a weirdo, but that is so cute. Then we have this little mine cart, and this might actually be my favorite piece of the set because it's so colorful. But um, the little jewels, the little diamonds on top come off and you put the sugar in there like a little sugar bowl. And that is what holds the sugar for your tea set. That is so stinking cute and pretty. And finally, we have the teacup, which is this bucket with the handle as a, um, a pickaxe for, for the diamond mine. This is such an incredibly creative little miniature tea set. And I had seen these. I had kind of noticed and glanced at these in the park, but I didn't realize how beautifully detailed they were. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? These are just great. I'm so impressed by these. Leanna, those were amazing. Thank you so much. And there's actually one more thing thing in this box and it actually is in the same theme as the tea set and it is a notebook you know my thing with fancy stationery I was just rambling about this and it's a snow white and the seven dwarves journal notebook and it's beautiful here's a look at the cover so you've got snow white in front of her cottage with all the dwarves all around and then the notebook has little tabs and the tabs are all seven dwarves and then when you open it up, there's decorated lined paper and then little um, notebook dividers as well. This is so ridiculously cute. See, I wanna use it right away and then I'm nervous because it's so pretty that I don't wanna ruin it with like my bad handwriting or by you know writing the wrong word and then scratching it out with my pen or something. But oh, it's gorgeous, thank you. That was an amazing box. Thank you, Leanna. I am so like tickled and, and honored that people would send me such like lovely things and I can't believe that little tea set. It's amazing. So big hugs to you in Sarasota. That's not too far from Disney World. Hopefully our paths will cross someday uh, in the Disney parks. And until then, smooches from uh, all the way up here in Minnesota. And that brings me around to this, my final piece of magic mail for today. And this is from Zona, or Zana, Zona in Phoenix, Arizona. So it's Zona from Arizona. I love it. And uh, there's a lot of really cute Disney stickers and um, washi tape on this. So thank you and hello all the way in Arizona. Oh, and this is an Easter card also. You all are really on the ball with your Easter cards. I've never really thought of sending Easter cards, but now I feel like maybe I should try to do that next year. But this one has Minnie Mouse and she's got a little Easter basket. It says it's Easter. And she says, Becca, I hope you have a nice Easter. Thank you for all your hard work on all the videos you put out. I love everything Disney and enjoy all the pins, unboxings, and trips. And then she says, we added some stickers, some my son made, and some are from the store. He does have a YouTube channel, so I will check out your YouTube channel and I'll link it down below as well. And thank you so much for the magic mail. Let's take a look at these fun stickers. So there are some um, princess stickers and a whole bunch of really glittery Mickey Mouse stickers. These are fun. Oops, there's Princess Jasmine and Raja in there too. I love Raja. And then there are also some gorgeous um, hand-drawn stickers. Your son made these. These are fantastic. They're really nicely done um, that I can peel and stick off. These will be beautiful for mailing or honestly I don't want to mail these. I want to keep these as keepsakes because they're so they're so pretty. I love the drawing and the the hand coloring. Thank you to Zona or Zana and your son for the stickers and also for the sweet card and I hope you also had a wonderful Easter with your family. And that is it for today's Magic Mail Monday. It wasn't too short but maybe just a titch shorter than I usually make my Magic Mail videos. And now I must go to the gym and then take a shower and then throw a baby shower. So there's a lot happening on this Monday. I hope your week is off to a fun and festive start. Mine certainly is. Leave a comment down down below and let me know either one thing you're grateful for this week or something that is fun about Monday or something that you're looking forward to this week and we'll just keep the, the positive energy flowing as much as we can around here. I'll be back soon with my Disney trip announcement finally and I've got some more unboxings coming up and, um, and all kinds of things. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button down below and I'll be back in the very near future. Until then, have a magical Monday, have a magical week, and I will see you real soon. Bye, guys. Mwah.